My lovely wife Laurie and I have recently been making a habit of going out locally around Perth for a few hours of photography once a week. G'day, Dan here from Epic Drives Western Australia. Today we're off to find the secret garden. It's so secret that I don't have any GPS coordinates for it. I'm not even sure if I'm allowed to give them out, but apparently when people have found it, there's heaps of people there walking dogs and stuff, so it's not exactly a secret. I think it kind of used to be, but we'll see if we can find it. Wish us luck. Hidden amongst thorny brambles in the middle of suburbia is the Hidden Gardens, a place of mystery and intrigue. We're off to discover it. Just past the car park, you get to the secret garden. There's only about 12 people here, so it's not exactly secret. It's pretty nice. So far, it's like little bridges and stuff you gotta cross over. That's kinda cool. We don't really have much of a plan about what we're going to film or even where exactly we intend on going. This week we're out in the city of Stirling to find the not so secret secret garden at Lake Gwella. If you've not heard of Perth's secret garden then you're probably not a serious Instagrammer. This place is kind of a big deal for grammars and an awesome place for novice photographers like us to challenge themselves. You can't help but feel like you're in some kind of jungle rainforest and no jungle would be complete without tigers and this particular jungle that'd be the snake variety. Yep, I reckon this joint would be home to more than just a few deadly tiger snakes so I'd suggest wearing a pair of solid hiking boots and tread heavily to alert them of your presence.
can reserve a spot there like that. Secretgardens.gov.au. I'm just joking. Um, it wasn't exactly hard to find, and I, I think I will put the GPS coordinates on there. What the hell? So, you know, send me your hate if I was meant to do that, but it doesn't seem very secret anymore anyway. I think most people in Perth know where it is. Catch up! This place is relatively easy to find, and if you follow the GPS coordinates at the bottom of the screen, it'll be even easier to find.